Hoking 3-row SUVs are a product of America, a huge shiny mirror that reflects all of our excesses and immodesties. Several classic big utes, the Cadillac Escalade, the Chevrolet Suburban, and the Lincoln Navigator among them, are, fittingly, produced by hometown carmakers. But foreign companies have been studying the art of the luxury hauler, and Mercedes-Benz's GLS class proves that those efforts are paying off. The GLS class is a stylish, spacious, and dynamically sound take on a family SUV. It may not have as much cargo space as a GMC Yukon XL, but there's no denying the touch of glamour that a three-pointed star brings to a vehicle. The GLS class feels much smaller than its size on the road, it's surprisingly quick and nimble, and, unlike many others in the class, it isn't onerous to park. Those are the qualities that help the GLS claim a 10 Best Trucks and SUVs title in 2017, and since it's virtually unchanged for 2018, it remains at the top of the class. Highs Above average driving dynamics, stellar powertrains, spacious and luxurious. Low High price, expected features cost extra, lacks cargo space behind the third row. Verdict Big and fast but composed and graceful, the GLS class is a status symbol worthy of its place atop the SUV mountain. What's new for 2018? Almost nothing. Mercedes added a new no-cost 19-inch wheel design to the GLS 450, but otherwise the GLS class sails into 2018 unchanged. Don't think Benz is asleep at the wheel, though, the GLS class was new for 2017. And we liked that model so much that we named it one of our 10 best trucks and SUVs for 2017. Even without a significant refresh for 2018, it's still head and shoulders above many other cars in the class. What was new for 2017? Mercedes renamed the GL class as the GLS class for 2017 to better parallel the nomenclature of its sedan lineup. An automatic stop. Start system became standard on every GLS model and helps conserve fuel and city driving. Inside, Benz's updated command system added a touchpad in addition to the rotary knob. Other revisions included new ambient lighting and trim colors, a three-spoke steering wheel, and an available design on Napa leather interior. Trims and options we choose. The entry-level GLS 450 should provide plenty of capability for most drivers, and it avoids the $25,400 premium that stepping up to the more powerful GLS 550 incurs. The GLS 450 comes standard with a rather barren interior that does not befit the model's $70,545 base price, but careful additions can increase the GLS 450's luxury quotient without seriously inflating the price. Standard features include 8-speaker audio system with 8.0-inch display Heated front seats Chrome and aluminum interior trim Heated and cooled front cup holders are too good to pass up at a relatively inexpensive $180. Looking to stand out a bit more? Then you might be interested in the $1,340 appearance package, which adds illuminated running boards along with 20-inch wheels.